Our storages are now completely upgraded and we're ready to start on our upgrades to the defenses and we're also going to add our mortar. I'm going to just go ahead and put the mortar in and uh, well, let me see if it's a good idea. It takes eight hours so it's going to tie up a builder for eight hours. I may hold off on that for a little while. We're going to upgrade 45 minutes on the cannon. Upgrade 45 minutes on the archer. And we're seeing we need gold. These um, walls they take a thousand to upgrade and we've got 50 walls the ones that have been upgraded cost 5,000 to upgrade so a thousand per level one wall for 50 pieces of wall is 50,000 gold so we may be able to get all the walls upgraded we may not We'll have to see. We'll have to do that while we have one builder available. I don't know. I'm going to have to calculate and see if we need to go and do an attack. In order to get some more gold. We have a uh, immovable object as an option, 10,000 each. Fool of gold, 20,000 gold and 6,000 elixir. It looks like they have an upgraded mortar. It looks a little larger than this other mortar. These other mortars, I should say. Well, there's a lot of defense there for 20,000 gold. That's what the other one looks like. A thousand each. Looks like one where we'd send in ten giants to take out the defenses, and then probably everything else. Well, the, the defenses take gold to upgrade, so we're, we're not going to be in a hard situation with the elixir. We've done a lot of the elixir buildings and upgrades, so that will continue to accumulate up to a hundred thousand. Well, I guess we'll close this video off and come back and do some more upgrades on defenses.